Oh jeez, I almost can't believe what this website did lately. Then again this website already had a bad reputation in my book. A few days ago, I saw how DeviantArt decided to make a post where they are bashing none other than the Mona Lisa, saying it's quote, an old, boring, and irrelevant shit, at least going by the shit emoji they added in their notification. This came up as ignorant and insultive to me, and I'll obviously going to explain why. From what I have been told over the years, one of the reasons the Mona Lisa is a pretty valuable and interesting piece of art was because her face is expressing multiple kinds of feelings. I think these people from this site seemingly don't know about details like that, since as far as I can tell, they never once mentioned details like what I just told you, and because of that, it comes up as ignorant. The other reason this feels ignorant and blasphemous is because the Mona Lisa is something that is not easy to criticize due to how ancient it is. I honestly think it's a pretty good piece of art for the time, and the reason I say that is simply because I understand it was a completely different time back then. It obviously wasn't easy to do certain things, and they didn't have as many iconic or efficient forms of media. That's another reason why this comes up as ignorance. And I think I don't need to tell you why this is also insultive and baffling, since their notification alone says it all. Now, you may be wondering, why I don't like this website. Well, it just so happens, that I did some digging a while back, since I was curious about how the people and the communities are, and when I found out about these people, I found mostly negative stuff about them. Not to mention, that most of the users are chicks. And don't get it wrong. I love to visit places with a lot of babes, but unfortunately, most of the chicks that use this website are selfish, boring, and they sometimes can't even take criticism. That is why I usually don't care about using this website, aside from the fact that I'm mostly not into drawing stuff. That's usually the type of shit that women are into, especially the ones that don't have any talent or patience trying something else. So yeah, I mostly have all of them figured out in that sense. I could go on and on about them, but I'll save that for another time. I'm sorry, but I think that this is such an awful take on an old piece of art. I bet if they said this in a museum, most people might look at them with a frowning face. Who is to say that your overly girly art won't become outdated and boring, and who is to say that you won't become old yourself? This thing gave me vibes that whoever thought it was okay to make this might be the same type of people that try to delete or rewrite history by doing things like destroying statues and praising drug addict criminals. And don't misunderstand, it's okay to dislike something, but I don't think it's okay to insult an ancient object and then try to make it fit your standards. Yes, we all have different standards, but because of that, it's not guaranteed that your version will be better. And quite frankly, I doubt a bunch of whiny snowflake bitches from this fucked up generation will be able to compare to an ancient generation. And I'm saying that, knowing that I'm technically part of them. Anyways, that's what I think about this. You can disagree if you want, but I just can't believe that a well-known website about making art would have such a shitty take on an old piece of art. I don't think anybody was making a lot of complaints about the Mona Lisa. So, if it ain't broken, don't fix it.